Hi. And welcome once again to Heartburn No More. This time we will see 5 inexpensive, natural remedies for reflux and heartburn. A visit to your local pharmacy will reveal shelves full of medicine to relieve heartburn. If you want natural remedies for reflux, you may have to do a little more research. Here are 5 ideas to get you started. The right kind of exercise. Walking is a simple activity that works in several ways to ease and even prevent heartburn. When you have acid reflux and or heartburn, gravity is your friend, anything that helps keep your stomach contents from coming up into your esophagus will prevent that burning sensation. When you walk, not job, after meals, you are giving your stomach a chance to finish digesting before you sit or lay down and put additional pressure on your stomach. Jogging and more active exercises increase the chances of acid bouncing up into your esophagus. Meal size. When you eat three large meals a day you put extra pressure on your less, lower esophageal sphincter. When you eat five to six smaller meals, you give your stomach a chance to process the food and empty faster. That combined with choosing your food carefully will help prevent heartburn. This goes for water as well. Drink in between meals, rather than with meals. You can still drink enough water, but you won't fill your stomach up so much that the contents have nowhere to go but up. Tracking your diet. You've probably discovered that some foods always seem to cause you heartburn. But, have you ever thought of tracking what you eat in a journal? When you track your food on paper for a couple of weeks, you will begin to see patterns that otherwise may have escaped you. You may find that it's not just certain foods by themselves that cause problems, but specific amounts or combinations of foods or the time of day they are consumed. As bothersome as it might be to write all of it down each day, the end result will be less heartburn and pain. You may want to track other activities as well, such as when and how much you exercise and when you nap and go to sleep for the night. The more information you have, the better your chances of identifying the true culprits that are causing you discomfort. Chewing gum. Saliva has coating properties that help protect your esophagus and chewing and swallowing encourage the muscles to keep pushing food down into your stomach. Choose non-mint varieties as mint will increase heartburn in some people. Another way to increase saliva is to hold 10 to 15 raisins in your mouth for a couple of minutes. Don't swallow them, just swallow the saliva and then spit the raisins out. It's weird but it works. Sleeping smart. Sleep helps your body to heal and recover. If you're having trouble sleeping due to acid reflux and heartburn pain, you will not get the benefit of this productive time. Try sleeping on your left side. Another trick is to raise the head of your bed 6 inches or so. Lying on a lot of pillows usually doesn't work because they move around when you're asleep. There are wedge pillows that might work better, but the idea is to raise your head above your stomach to keep the contents where they belong. Wait 2 to 3 hours after eating before you lie down to help your stomach empty and avoid heavy meals before bedtime. Everyone is different, but hopefully some of these natural remedies for reflux and heartburn will help you gain control over your discomfort. If you need more information or want a definitive solution for acid reflux, you can visit my website. Here you will find the most powerful natural treatment for acid reflux that exists today. For your convenience, you just have to click the link in description of this video.